Welcome back, everybody. I'm Bridget Blight. There is an important development to share with you when it comes to in vitro fertilization. So today, our medical expert, Dr. Malika Marshall, is talking with another expert about how the process is changing. Good morning, Malika. Good morning, Bridget. You know, Boston IVF has come up with a saliva test for monitoring infertility treatments. It would replace the customary blood test. Dr. Michael Alper, Boston IVF's medical director, is here to talk about it. Welcome, Dr. Alper. Thanks for having me. All right, so let's give people just a, some basic background. What sort of is involved in an in vitro fertilization treatment? In vitro fertilization, also called IVF or test tube baby, involves medications to cause multiple eggs to form on the ovaries, and then a minor procedure to remove the eggs, mix them with sperm, create embryos, then have the embryos replaced into the woman's uterus. Okay, so it's a fairly popular treatment these days. Absolutely. And as someone myself who has gone through a lot of fertility treatments, mm -hmm. I know that there are a lot of blood tests involved. So why do women have to undergo blood, blood tests? How often are they done? And what exactly are you measuring? During the cycle, which lasts approximately two weeks, uh, a woman would have to get typically anywhere between three and seven blood tests to monitor hormone levels in the blood that help us determine the correct dosage of medication to use during the cycle. And sometimes that can end up being dozens and dozens of Oh, absolutely. Blood tests. When you add the injections, the venipunctures or the blood tests, it's a major undertaking. Okay, so now there's a new saliva test that might replace right. some of those blood tests, is that right? Exactly. So at Boston IVF over the last year and a half, We've been doing research and we found that we can measure these hormones not just in blood but also in saliva. So instead of having to have needle sticks throughout the cycle, now what we can do is just ask the patient to produce a little bit of uh, saliva in a small test tube which looks like this and uh, we do the test on that uh, sample. Okay, so for someone who might have a needle phobia or even someone who doesn't like myself it might sort of prevent some of the angst involved with Absolutely. IVF treatments. Because of all the, uh, because of what's involved with IVF, the multiple injections, the blood tests, the minor surgery and so on, people can get stressed going through this uh, procedure. So anything that can reduce the stress is going to be helpful and uh, to make the process more patient friendly. So when might something like this be widely available here in Massachusetts? Well, we offer it now. Uh, so any patient who sees us at Boston IVF can have the saliva test and avoid having uh, needle sticks. And uh, we'll be offering it to all of our centers shortly. And then hopefully uh, we'll work with the company to commercialize it so other IVF centers around the country can also uh, use this technique.